Hello everybody, this is Boaz Fala and I'm here with the Daily Astrology Forecast for December 9th, 2015. A lot is happening today in the skies. First of all, we are waking up to a morning with an optimistic edge to it with the sextile to Jupiter. Even though it's a moon in Scorpio, we could feel like our juices are running in a very nice way this morning. But right after that, it becomes a black moon again and it's more sober, darker tone of the last few days comes back up to the surface and you, if you are in the states then you'll be waking up to a black moon already the thing is that there's also this square between the sun and chiron and the trine to uranus telling us that this is a time in which we deal with past trauma with places that we're hurt in places that we haven't solved yet emotionally in our life and we need to utilize our higher mind and think differently in an innovative manner think outside the box regarding all emotional problems another system that is happening in the skies today is the t square there's an opposition between uranus and mars with pluto providing a pyramid uh, in this triangle in the sky that puts us all on overdrive and we all are a little more edgy we're very much in touch with our lower energies and we, we literally need to be careful from earthquakes in our lives uh, this is a time for trans transformative change. This is a time that we should be more careful regarding accidents or uh, um, fights. Uh, uh, anything in our relationship can easily combust right now. And it's a bit as if we have this angel on one shoulder and a devil on the other. And because in this time, we're very much in touch with our lower chakras, with our lower energies. They're very much twisting and turning within us. And our challenge is to overcome and transcend above them and really take ourselves and our relationships to a new level. So there's a saying uh, that says, you should live your life by yourself as if you are in front of many people. And live in front of many people as if you are in front of God. So take that and I hope it's going to prove a positive day for all of us. And I'll be happy to see you all with me here tomorrow. Thank you for listening. This was Father. Goodbye.